So today we have the Navage nasal hair. Um, usually it's used for like our allergies, people that have allergies. I don't have allergies. I had a deviated septum. And I had surgery, so I have issues with uh, it being getting clogged up and dried up all the time. Um, but it comes with these little things for uh, salted water. Um, you put it where the styrofoam part is down. I already have it filled up completely to the line. So you just put that in there and then you close it. I don't know if I did that right, but that was really hard to close. Um, then it comes with these, right? So you have the arrows on both sides. One's for going in, one's for going out. So depending on which one you do, you want to use first. So you're gonna have to do this twice. Now I don't even know if this requires batteries because it didn't say. Nor do I know how to do that. Oh, look at that. Oh, ah. so it's working and doesn't require batteries. I'm assuming. So I'm gonna go ahead and, and use it for you guys. Um, now I just had my nose cauterized yesterday, so you might get see some stuff coming out depending on which side is going. So my right nostril is going to go in, or the left is going in, the right is going out. Um, let's see how this works. Got like a little container here, so just in case it goes out. So yeah. Oh man. Now you can see what came out. Not so much. It's not as bad as everyone makes it seem to be. Um. But yeah, there's that. That's for one. Let's try the next one. So now, since I did it one side, you gotta take this out. Oh, you don't have to take it out. Yeah, you just swap right over. Bada bing, bada boom. Pretty simple and easy, right? So now, do the other side. About the same as the last one. Then to empty it out, click that way, boom, and it has a little hole. So I just pour it in here. Pretty simple. Um, actually, didn't feel that uncomfortable to me. Um, sorry, it didn't feel that uncomfortable for me. But the breathing is a lot better. So, I mean, there's that. So, I think it works pretty good. I think my breathing is about 50% better than it was earlier. It was uncomfortable for like the, on my, the first side, a little bit more, but the second side, it would, I didn't even know it was actually working. I thought it was like, it wasn't working at first. Uh, but it's pretty interesting. Um, so supposedly it's supposed to clear you out. It's mostly for people with, um, with allergies. Now, I don't have allergies, but I have, I have a, a problem with my nasals getting dried out and then causing, uh, like scabs and all that inside there on its own. Uh, so I tried getting one of these is a hundred bucks at Rite Aid. So I'm hoping, oh, here's the batteries. Batteries underneath. So it comes with batteries already. Yes. Interested. So, yeah. I'm hoping that it helps me with the, my uh, dry nasals all the time. Uh, so, but I mean, I work in, at, for UPS and it's supposed to clear out all the dirt and everything. So, uh, if I use that on a daily uh, that'd be a good uh, 
way to clear out my nasals from all, all the nasty junk and dirt. Use it on a daily or like at least once a week or something like that. But I think it's a pretty good product. 100 bucks might be a little pricey for me. Uh, I still bought it, but I think it still is a little expensive. Um, but hey, pretty cool. Well, if you guys watched this far, go ahead, hit a like and subscribe. I appreciate every single one of you.